Hey, Ben, uh, just a two-parter for you. Uh, first, I don't think we've spoken to you since after game one, so I wanted to get your response to uh, the Defensive Player of the Year award vote. Uh, yeah, congrats to Rudy. <laughs> I mean, I don't really – it is what it is. I'm not really concerned about individual awards. Um, I, want the, I want the championship, so, I mean, that, that's, that's my goal. Um, honestly, the goal was never Defensive Player of the Year. It's just go out there – and do my job and, and try to be the best defender in the league, uh, regardless of you know the awards. Um, but the ultimate goal is a championship. And I still got to do my job at a high level. Uh, and uh, sticking to the night, Doc told us that he, he kind of challenged you a little bit at halftime. Uh, he felt like you could push the pace more. He was going to operate out of the post through you. And then he said one of the assistant coaches said like, "Hey, like he is guarding Trey Young. Like that's." That's a lot. And then Doc said, well, you know, he's, he's young. He can handle it. Uh, what did you think of uh, what you did in the second half? Um, yeah, I was just trying to push the pace, um, get in the lanes, find my guys, and, you know, stay aggressive, get to the rim, um, you know, and cause them to, you know, obviously foul uh, and get in some rhythm. So, you know, I think I did a good job at that, that second period, the second half. Um, so, yeah. Paul Hudrick. Hey, Ben, we, we've talked all year about you and Joe and, you know, your chemistry and how much it's grown, but even kind of throwing Tobias in the in that mix, how much has that helped you guys, you know, the three of you having that continuity and it kind of like coming all together on a night like tonight? Uh, it's been great. You know, obviously it's, it's, it's a lot harder to do with three, three um, than, than two. Um, you know, Joel and I have you know, had that chemistry and played in the court for a while now. Um, and then, you know, working – Working with Tobias, uh, he's made it easy. You know, he's continued to get better and better. Um, and he's been a great fit, you know, offensively. And then defensively, he's stepped up his game a whole lot. Um, so when, you know, all three of us are in sync, you know, it, it's very tough uh, for the opposition. Thanks, man. Lauren Rosen. Hey, Ben, you told me after game one that you were really looking forward to more opportunities to guard Trey Young and to get physical in that matchup. Now you've had two games, two wins, getting to do just that alongside Matisse. How has that experience now informed your confidence for the next few games, assuming that you'll have more opportunities there? Yeah, I don't think the confidence has always been there um, defensively. You know, he, he's a smart young player, so, um, you know, I got a lot of respect to him. So every, every game's going to be a little different. Um, tonight, you know, he slowed it down, um, picked his spots and really attacked. But, um, no, nah, I, I look forward to guarding the best player every night, so. No, that's my job. Um, and then sort of on a different note, Furkan had a great game tonight after struggling a little bit earlier in the series. And I know you guys really embrace him on the bench when he plays well. Can you just tell us a little more about his role on this team? Yeah, he's great. You no, know, he's a weapon. Um, he's, he's had a lot of great moments, you know, wearing a Sixers jersey. Um, and I love playing with him. So you know, offensively, he's great. Um, and defensively, he's really stepped up too. He's another guy who's um, taking on the challenge of, of guarding his man. Final question, we'll go to Al Thompson. Hey, uh, ben, uh, you've had two double-digit wins in a row now. Um, as a leader, uh, are you, like, leading the way to make sure that you don't have any kind of even uh, drifting into the thought that maybe you have this or that, uh, you know, you got this now? Is there a thought yeah. to that to keep keep it up? Yeah, we can't do that. This is the playoffs. Um, I mean, you saw it You saw it in game one with us. We were down 26 and we came back. Um you know, everybody's in the playoffs for a reason. Um, this is a good team, so we can't let up regardless of, you know, if we're up 10, 20, uh, 30. Cool. All right. Thank you, Ben. All right. Thank you. All right, everyone.